everybody and welcome again to Z Code Sports System. Here we developed automated systems to help you win big every time. It doesn't matter what sport you're betting on, we've got you covered. So we're going to get into these four NHL games for uh, Monday, March 6th. But before I do, I want to show you this uh, VIP club section. I invite you to join and it has all the tools to help you make your picks. Okay, so let's get down to the first one. First one here was Edmonton and Buffalo. If you look here at the charts here, you can see that both teams are average stats at the moment. Edmonton has coming off of a win and three and three over their last six. You see Buffalo coming off of a loss. They are four and two over their last six. If you look at the over under chart here, you can see that Edmonton over in five of the last six. Buffalo is over in four of the last six. On the power ranks indicator, you can see an up and downward trend. Both teams on the downward trend. Buffalo is at plus 11. Edmonton has dropped from 17 to plus 8. Uh, the score predictor has Buffalo 4-3 to three with 43.4% level of confidence in predictions. That's less than that chance of a toss of a coin. If you look at the head-to-head -head between the two teams, you can see back on October 18th, Buffalo won 4-2 on the road as a heavy underdog in that one. The stability factor you can see here that um, Buffalo is at plus 7. They were as high as plus 11, so they have dipped and they have not been as consistent over the last few months of the season. And Edmonton has been very inconsistent at minus 2. So in the end, though, I like Buffalo at home in a game going over the line. Okay, the next one we want to look at down here, number 2, Calgary and Dallas. You can see both teams are not playing their best, although Dallas has won two of their last three, but they're just two and four of their last six, but they're still first in their division. Calgary is uh, coming off of three straight losses, two of those in overtime, and they are ice cold down. You see the score predictor has Dallas by a four to three score with 55% level of confidence. And take a, a note of this, that the teams have been trending in games over the line. You can see uh, Dallas in their last five and um, Calgary four out of their last five. Uh, the power ranks indicator chart, if you look at this, you can see up and down. We're moving for both charts. Um, Dallas now at the plus 23, Calgary at plus 10. Head-to-head, -head, the two teams met back on January the 14th, and it was a very high-scoring game. You see Calgary 6-5, to five, and the, the odds were very tight. Dallas was a side home favorite in that one, but they came up short. If you look at the stability factor, Calgary is more consistent. Uh, excuse me, that's Dallas is more consistent. Plus eight, Calgary is at plus one. So they're not performing as well with respect to their fair to underdog status. So in the end, though, I do think this is a Dallas game by two in a game going over the line. Next one we want to look at is Ottawa and Chicago. You can see Ottawa coming in burning hot, winners of their last three. Chicago is... Uh, average, you can see that they have two losses after four straight wins prior to that. If you look at the over-under chart, four straight for Chicago over, and Ottawa three straight over as well. The score predictor has Chicago by a 4-3 to three score, and the confidence in predictions at 66%, which is up a bit from when I just looked at it previously. Uh, the power ranks indicator chart, you can see that Chicago is down near the bottom of the league for quite a while. They did climb up to plus 11, but now they've Hit a tailspin again there at plus two, while Ottawa has increased from plus seven just about a week ago, and they are now at plus 14. The stability factor, you can see that both teams are very consistent with regard to their favorite underdog status, plus 19 for Ottawa, plus 21 for Chicago. In the head-to-head -head matchups this year, you can see back on February the 17th, so not far uh, ago, it was Chicago 4-3 in overtime, and they won on the road as a heavy underdog. This time, I think it's going to be Ottawa, and I like them in the game over the line. Okay, there's one more here. We want to look at Washington and Los Angeles. You can see here that Los Angeles comes in with a pretty substantial uh, odds in their favorite, 1.59 to 2.584. Their average status winners of two of their last three. Well, Washington's also two and one over there last year, and they're ice cold up. Uh, notice that Washington is has been involved in games over the line three of their last four, and Los Angeles in four 
straight and five out of their last six. Uh, the score predictor has Los Angeles by a substantial margin, four to one, with a very good uh, level of confidence of 62%. If you take a look at the power ranks indicator, Los Angeles has been stable at plus 26, while Washington is at plus 17. They have been up and down. Head to head wise, you can see that um, back on October 22nd, it was Washington 4 to 3, and they won as a home favorite. So in this one here, I believe this is going to be a Kings win. I like them to even the score, but I will pass on the over under bet. Okay, so there you have it. Those are the four games for the NHL for March the 6th. Happy betting, and we'll see you next time.